Good morning, everybody. It's Friday morning. I have the, the day off. We are at the library right now. And seeing as it's the first of the month, the library gives out passes for various, free passes for various, um, what, museums for the month. But they only give out, how many do they give out? Four. Four? So we are here first thing to try and get one of these things. And if we do, it's going to be awesome. Yes, they are getting ready for the 4th of July, I guess they call it the Western Stampede. And I have never actually been in a carnival, but it's been empty. This is really kind of cool. Yes, and that's, uh, that's the carousel over there. This. There's nobody here. It's too early in the morning. I'm just gonna walk down here. I'm probably gonna get kicked out. This isn't too bouncy for you. I'm still experimenting with the whole 360 thing. And I'll end first in line. I'll meet you right back there as soon as I open this. Last night I tried and I was one of the four, but you there was another so family. <laughs> I, I didn't mean to brag, I just want, I no, hope you didn't I, mess this up. I, uh, but I, I told, I um, talked to my boss about you, my entire staff was oh, so no, inspired. No, you shouldn't because we were... So we got it, it's for the, which museum? It There's a bunch of them. It is for Discovery Gateway. Leonardo, oh, cool. the National Natural History Museum, Redview Garden, Utah Museum of Fine Arts. Cool. Yeah. That is Sherry Ann's car in front of us. We are dropping that off for an oil change. We're going to leave that there and then we are headed out of town. I think we're going to go up in the mountains to get out of some of this heat. Nice little place um, called uh, Cascade Springs that I think we're going to head to. How much is a National Parks Pass?
she's absolutely right. It's a moose. There's a moose. Not a place to pull off either. Nice spotting Anna Lynn. Anna Lynn found two moose. That's a buck, a isn't it? Sure. I think it's worth a buck. Yes, it is. We made it to Cascade Springs. Look at this old tree trunk. This is just a gorgeous area. You can already hear the water. Look at that. Grab my camera. Is once again trying to get a good photo of Anna Lynn, which is difficult to do because Anna Lynn tends to goof off when her mother's trying to photograph her. Thrift store to snoop around in. We've got rooms all over the place filled with different stuff. I think this is bedding. Um, there is a charity that the women in my neighborhood are gathering for called Days for Girls. And there are girls around the world that don't have feminine hygiene products, don't have tampons or pads. And because of that, 
they stay home from school, they hide. Um, some of them are married off as early as age 10 or 12 because they're deemed a woman because they have their period. Um, and what this program does is it sends them a little bar of soap and some flannel liners and some underwear and a plastic liner. And the flannels they can wash with the hand soap and be discreet about it. They don't have to miss school. Um, a lot of them end up dropping out of school and don't have any hope because they just miss so many days because they have to stay home. Cool. So they need hotel size soaps and I just found a bunch. Just picked up Sherry Ann's car. She is right behind us back there. And uh, now we're heading home. And it's been a really good day so far. I'm really excited to see what I can do uh, with this 360 video. And so um, hopefully you guys will be seeing this um, at some point because hopefully it worked.